Tony Johnson is almost entirely blind, but he's been intrigued by martial arts since he was a kid. He started wrestling at Smith High School and later blossomed at the sport while at Governor Moorhead School for the Blind in Raleigh. It wasn't enough for him. He wanted more. So I then I started dabbling in other martial arts, Bushido Kempo and karate. I got tired of punching that punching at the air because being blind I couldn't compete. So then that led me to judo and it's you know a lot like wrestling. I've been here ever since. There's so much to do, so many techniques you can do. It's never boring. It's never monotonous. Success is what draws me to judo. Unlike karate, you know they could tell me I'm doing it right by punching, but there's no gratification. You know I'm not hitting something. Um, but in, in, in judo, I get to execute the throw. I get to execute the choke. It starts out first really being picked up. When you're up in the air <laughs> and you can't see, sometimes your equilibrium goes off and you have no idea if you're going up or down. And that, that's the weirdest feeling. I trust my teammates. They don't want to hurt me and likewise I don't want to hurt them. When I hit the mat, uh, since I've been taught how to fall, it's really no big deal. It's hard to, to, to listen and to feel their body. Uh, to stay focused on everything at the same time. That's my biggest challenge, is trying to figure out what they're going to do before they do it. And, and, and sometimes, you know, it's over before it happens. I can feel the rise and fall in their shoulders. If they're stepping with their right foot, their right shoulder rises. And that tells me where their feet are if I'm focusing on their upper body. But if I'm listening to their feet, I lose focus of the upper body. When they turn their, uh, their torso, when it turns, you know, I, I can feel it through the uniform, hoping to anticipate their next move. I've always looked at the martial artists, he's like, wow, I'd, I'd love to do that, you know. You know uh, but now that I'm here, I, I just enjoy the sport. It just makes me feel good about myself that I'm not at home sitting around feeling sorry for myself. I'm, I'm actually out here living my life and, and enjoying what I, I, I like to do.